and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video again today. I'm going to go over what you guys should be expecting and what you guys should be doing before Super Bowl promo part two. As you guys know, they are segmenting this. Now, I only know what the second segment's going to be. I can't assure you what, I, I can't like reassure you what the third part's going to be because I really don't know. What I mean by that is they dropped it on Friday, Super Bowl promo part one. You guys should already know what that is. I'll go over a little bit as we get into the video, but in essence, Super Bowl part one was the first master set with Steve Young with three pieces with the past, right? Now, I think we'll get more past stuff. I don't think that's done, but we definitely are in line for a present. Now, a Madden Super Bowl present, just it just involves the players from the current Super Bowl. So 49ers players and Kansas City Chiefs players. Very self-explanatory. And we're going over who we could be expecting from that, kind of what you guys should be doing before we get all those players, and kind of what I'm excited for going forward. Now, part three, I don't know what it could be. Part three could be LTDs and stuff, or like performers from other Super Bowls that aren't just past or like a mix of past and present. I really don't know what they could do beyond that. Like, I really don't know what's, it's always been past and present, or it could be the red and blue team. Like last year, that's possible. We don't, I mean, we gotta, we gotta wait and see. Hopefully it comes out Monday. That's kind of what I'm expecting. The Super Bowl is going to be this following, not today, but this following Sunday. So that's a week. They'll probably split it up by three and three days, but that'll almost be time. So I feel like it's going to be within Monday and Wednesday, probably will be the next two content drops. That's kind of what I'm expecting. But guys, before we get into this video, make sure down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, boys. Come join the family and get to 20K as quickly as possible. Next big milestone we got to hit, boys. Community's grown. Thank you guys so much for that. Comment down below what you guys think you should be doing and what you're expecting for Super Bowl Part 2. And if you guys have any idea of Part 3, let me know down below in the comment section. I'm assuming blue blue and red team or something like that or LTDs. But I really don't know just yet. And can we get this video a big thumbs up for our 1030 video today? Can we get 200 likes in this video, guys? We greatly appreciate it. Now let's get into this video. So, as you guys already know, I, I kind of touched on this in the former video. Super Bowl promo Part 1 was Super Bowl past, as you guys do now here. So, Super Bowl Part 1, Steve Young past master. So I'm expecting this promo to be sort of like the Zero Chill Ghost. It's going to be the future, the present, and the past, except this will only be past and present, right? So I don't know what the overalls would be like. So I would prefer to see the, the present master as a 97. That's what I'd prefer. But they could just do 96 and 96. It's very possible. Yeah, they just keep both 96s because past and present... There's no differential. Like, it made sense in the other, in the Ghost of Madden. Like, Ghost of Madden Future, they should be lower overalls because they're rookies who haven't really proved, excuse me, proved themselves yet. So, you kind of want them to be lower overalls. These are players that are in the Super Bowl now or were in the Super Bowl. So, they're kind of at the same stature, you guys. You know what I'm saying? So, in the present set, the present set's going to be weird, right? Could they do two present sets? Could they do a 49ers and a Chiefs present set? Because they can't do both, right? I mean, they could do both, but in one set, only one player is going to get the top overall card. Now, who would I expect for one of the present masters? I'm expecting a Tyree Kill, a Mitchell Schwartz, a Richard Sherman. Those are the three most likely guys, in my opinion, because I can't see it being Raheem Mustard. I can't. I don't think they'd end up doing that. Does he have a chance to Super Bowl MVP? Yes, but I don't see that. Fred Warner, maybe. But for the Chiefs, it's gotta be, it's got I think it's gotta be Tyree Killer, Mitchell Schwartz for them. Travis Kelsey just got a card, so I don't think I don't think it'll be him. And Mahomes, I think they they wanna wait to see if Mahomes gets a Super Bowl performer type card or if he gets an MVP card. I don't know. I mean they could give us the master, that'd be super cool. I wouldn't mind a Mahomes card as a master. Which would honestly be smart on their part to give us the 96 Mahomes, because then if he gets a 99 Super Bowl MVP, whatever, like it's 96, 99, it makes sense. But if you give him like if you wait and he doesn't get the MVP, he doesn't get a card now. So I don't really know what they're gonna do with that, but like I said, from the Chiefs, Tyreek Hill. Mahomes is like an outside shot, although I think it makes sense, but I don't know if they'd actually do it. Or Mitchell Schwartz. Maybe, I don't know, defensively. Maybe maybe Tyra Matthew. Maybe D Ford. Or um, Frank Clark. There's a few guys, right? Either way, they're all solid options. Now, from the Niners, Garoppolo has a chance, because Garoppolo really hasn't gotten a card in a while. So I can see Garoppolo getting it, although I wouldn't want a Garoppolo card. I wouldn't want back to back master quarterbacks. Because that just like, kind of gets annoying. Because I want to get a card that like, I can do the set for. And I really don't need a quarterback. Richard Sherman. If they gave us a Richard Sherman master, I'd 100% do it. Richard Sherman's going to be at a point where he's going to be super solid. Probably going to get like a 93 speed. But chemmed up in powder. He's probably going to like a 95. And he's going to have like 99 press, 99 zone, 99 man. That's what I'm kind of expecting for the present set. But remember, there's going to be little pieces too. So all those guys I named will probably be in this promo. They just won't be all big. One of them will be a master. And there'll be like a 93 Frank Clark. And maybe like a 90 D Ford. And then maybe like a Kendall Fuller. 
or a, a Raheem Mustard, like 90, 93. Like, that's the kind of stuff. You're going to see it all brackets. So, you're going to take the two top players from each team. One of them will be the master, and the rest will be all lower end players. So, you're going to see all of them probably, just like you see here. Now, the other cards will be lower end, just pieces in general, right? Now, these are going to be. Now, as far as the three big ones, this is what's going to be those more, more of the main guys' names. So, let's say the master is going to be Tyree Kill, and the three here are going to be like uh, Fred Warner. Mitchell Schwartz and Sherman like that'd be something cool we could see I don't think it's gonna be Sherman as if there's gonna be a Sherman it's going to be a master he does have his LTD Christmas card so it'd have to be the master to make him higher overall but that pretty much wraps up that now as far as solos go it's gonna be a similar similar layout first off they're gonna increase the solos they're gonna be they're gonna obviously increase the daily solos and by daily I mean the ones that are going to be uh, added on to as you guys see here we go up to Super Bowl history of the Super Bowl this is some of the greatest games in history They'll probably add some more to these, or they're going to add a whole new sequence, because obviously there's a lot more tiers to get than the solos available. And maybe they'll do, they might do like a road Super Bowl, which is, I think will drop Monday. They usually do a road Super Bowl, which is like a solo sequence where you play like all the games in the playoffs this year or something like that, and you work your way to the Super Bowl where the Niners game is at, and you play the game, and you actually get to pick at the end like a collectible of who you think will win, which could be like a predictor collectible, as well as, they in years past, they've given us like 50k, which is a really cool solo sequence, it's like 10k per game, and then 50k at the end, it could be like 100k. So that'd be cool if they did something like that. I do see a pretty cool solo sequence coming, as well as maybe one free more, one more free player. Obviously, the tickets are going to be the free players once you get them all. Oh, and as well as expect another free ticket set, right? So I got my Twitch drop pack right here. Let's pull some heat real quick before we continue this video. Let's get our power up Lamar Jackson. Maybe a solid pull. Imagine getting tribute to Eli Manning out of this pack. That'd be crazy. I'd, go, I'd probably go wild if I got my first LT out of a Twitch pack. Yeah, so as I was recording this video, of course, some content dropped. I was not expecting it. So as you guys probably already saw with my 1030 video, you'll probably see this more around like somewhere between two or five. So Mel Renfro did just drop in the game. You guys probably saw my 1030 video. If not, I'll show them in here. But this also comes into what to expect. So now that we saw this, we can talk further on what we expect because I was referencing to you guys. I think they could be dropping some LTDs throughout the Super Bowl promo. That could be a part of it. So start expecting LTD drops because clearly they're doing that. Now, if you guys haven't seen the video, go watch my 1030 video. Go more in depth on him. I'm just going to brief, uh, briefly brush over it. Mel Renfro, LTD Super Bowl Legend Pass to come out. So now we can also expect that there will be a Super Bowl present LTD, more than likely. The only issue, right, with this is that a Super Bowl Pass LTD is easy, right? There's 50 plus years of Super Bowls. You can just go back and find any player from any Super Bowl. Right? It's very simple. The present one can only be on this Super Bowl, and we won't know who we should put there until they play it, as well as Madden can't just like do Mahomes LTD, because what if Mahomes gets MVP? Then we get an LTD, an MVP. You know, they got to be careful with that stuff. So I do expect more LTD cards, but I think we'll probably be getting more pass than present. The only way we get past LTDs is if we get one after the Super Bowl's over. Like, let's say uh, Mahomes gets MVP, right? But on the 49er side, Rich, Richard Sherman has an insane game, right? So that maybe he can get an LTD the day after. Only thing I can see happening. Other than that, I don't really think Presence will get much Super Bowl LTD. I think it's going to be more of a pass. So Eli's out of the question, right? Because you already have one. Tom Brady can get a Super Bowl LTD from the past. Maybe they're going to go a little bit older. I don't really know, you know. Troy Aikman maybe gets a Super Bowl LTD. You know, one of those type guys. Troy Aikman hasn't gotten an upgrade in a while. Someone I could definitely see. Emmett Smith. Who knows, right? But the point is, now that they've done that and they have confirmed they will be doing that, we can be expecting that. So, so far, we can expect, obviously, a road to Super Bowl type solo. Some more solos. There's going to be plenty more. Maybe another free player. Expect a Super Bowl pa a presence set, obviously, with those players. The name Sammy Watkins, by the way, was the one. I don't know if I forgot him before. Definitely a guy you want to be looking out for in terms of can he get a card. And don't also forget that we will be having a third part. Now, the third part, like I said, could it be a bunch of LTDs? Could it be right after Super Bowl they drop something? Or could it be the red and blue team? Red and blue team seems most likely. And I think the way the contest is going to be, I think we'll probably get the next part tomorrow as well as the last part by Wednesday. That will make the most sense, Super Bowl Sunday. Or the worst I could see is last part Friday at worst. But it can't be Saturday or Sunday. Saturday's Legends. Maybe Friday they'll drop like the red and blue team. You got to pick before the Super Bowl. Only way I can see it happening. I think more than likely we'll see a content drop Monday and Wednesday. Or at least I'm hoping that as a content creating YouTuber. It'll, be, it'll, be, it'll make more sense for me. You can get some content for you guys out by tomorrow. But we have to wait and see, obviously. But I, that's pretty much what to expect. What I'll be doing. Bef what, what I'm personally doing before then. Like I told you, I didn't really touch the first part. I'm Mel Renfro and the first few um, batch of players. I'm really not touching. I'm more interested in the Ghost. I mean the Ghost. The Super Bowl present players. Because I want a Mahomes. I want a Hill. I want a Sherman. I'm waiting for those players, as well as I have the Super Bowl collectibles, so I'm super hyped for the next phase of this promo. The first part was just like the appetizers, so we have to understand that. But guys, that is about it for the video. Make sure you're going to below. 
If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Boys, get to 20K as quickly as possible. Comment down below what you expect next. Who do you think the Masters will be and kind of what do you want to add to this? And make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get 300 likes on this video, guys? I'd be greatly appreciated. And make sure if you want to see my run for own depth and my personal opinion, go down below and check out the other video that I did post this morning at 1030. All right, guys. That's pretty much wrapped up the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. See you in the next video. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm out. Peace.